Well, they want to help, but they're an ocean away. Boats from right here are creating a supply chain between the United States and the British Virgin Islands hit hard by recent hurricanes. The nonprofit International Rescue Group is spearheading this mission, and WSA 9's Stephanie Gelhardt has the story for us. My wife Debbie and I lived on Joost Van Dyke for about two and a half years. We managed a small resort there, and we just came back to the States in March, and then came the hurricane. And the hurricane really destroyed the houses and life, the, the income and the lifestyles of, of most of the people that we know and love down there. And that was bad enough, but then when Maria came through, it really decimated the supply chain, which was Puerto Rico. To the rescue, Rendezvous Cay, a 50-foot sailboat filled with much-needed supplies. Most of them lost their homes. The people that have homes have congregated together and are sharing. And right now they're living in tents, so we're trying to get building supplies so they can build homes again. We're dedicated to it 100% because these are people that we feel strongly about and we care deeply about. Disaster relief from the sea. Matthew Hawk is the captain. It takes you out of the little um, perspective of, of myself and how am I surviving and what's important to me. Instead of my ego being involved, it's like, how am I making a difference in the lives of other people? I mean, America has such opulence and such opportunity but that doesn't mean that we need to just be concentrated on ourselves. There's a big world that we're a part of, and being connected to the ocean, you're more tied into uh, the ocean community. The catamaran sets sail in a few days. It's going to take between 10 and 14 days to reach the Virgin Islands. Stephanie Galehard, WUSA 9. And another boat filled with supplies is scheduled to depart from Annapolis in just a few weeks. If you'd like to help, go to our, dubs uh, bleh, our website, yeah, that happens, WUSA9.com for more information.